Hi guys, hope you're all well. If you're new to Siege Studios, we're a premium miniature painting service with over 30 artists. Here at Siege we offer four painting levels, ranging from our bronze, premium gaming quality, up to our platinum competition standard. For your free quote today, follow the link in the description of this video. So first up from this awesome Brazen Claw Force, we've got the three characters of the Shadow Spear Box. We've got the Phobos Librarian, the Captain, and also Lieutenant. Um, three really cool miniatures uh, and some of my favourite uh, Primaris models uh, from the current range. Uh, we'll start with the Librarian, which I think probably is my favourite. Um, again, Ben, who's the artist who's worked on this project, has done an absolutely stellar job across the force. Um, really lovely, lovely coloration choices on this as well. Obviously, Librarian being blue, uh, needed the red accent, obviously, the brazen claws, and uh, Ben's done a great job of distinguishing that by the sort of quartered pad, and also half of the free breather on the face mask being red as well, but then having the traditional blue colour of the Librarian through. Really lovely brush blended sword here as well, which is really, really nice. Uh, you can see the camo pattern uh, to match that kind of drab, kind of um, ash waste kind of basing that's happened on this, uh, on this force as well, and you'll see that all the way across. Uh, on all the camo areas of the models. And again, you can see that sort of quartered brazen claw scheme on the backpack there as well. It's just, just little little in, um, little areas of detail that show obviously he is from the brazen claws chapter. Really do like the yellow pipes as well. All the book details are done really nicely. All the text on the purity seals is done as well, which is really lovely. Uh, and moving around again, you've got that awesome pose as well, just using one of his psychic powers there. Stellar miniature, all the keys and everything all picked out, multiple highlighting done on all the gold work, silvers, uh, and you can see that super sharp highlighting done on all the armor panels and areas as well. Lovely subtle amounts of contrast added on there as well. So that's just the Phobos Librarian. Next up, let's have a look at the uh, Phobos Captain. Really, really cool miniature. Very, very stoic pose there, as you'll see, with his little friend here as well. Um, you can see the screen with all the blips and dials and dots on it all done as well. Every little gem and lens all fully painted. You obviously got the purity seals done with a complementary green as well to the red, uh, just to make those stand out and uh, really distinguish those on the armor, as you can see. Uh, I like the yellow crest as well, really reminds me of kind of like a second edition kind of scheme. Uh, I love the white casings on the guns as well, I think it really, really works and just uh, makes them stand out compared to the mass coloration of the miniature itself. Um, you can see all the little details all fully painted and fully highlighted through various stages to a really, really super, super finish. Uh, you've got brazen written there on that pad, uh, on that text bit there. On that pad you can see the little screens and dials and everything all fully painted um, and all the little lenses on top of the bolter and everything all done as well uh, but this is just the phobos captain again really really awesome awesome miniature with that great sort of ash waist camo pattern done on the um, on the camo shrouds as well which is really lovely so that's just the captain and then last of the three characters, we've got the uh, Phobos Lieutenant. Again, a very, very awesome pose. Looks like he's advancing, as you can see. Uh, that lovely white cowling on the bolter, uh, just with the green lenses as well. And uh, on the blue side of the armor, you can see obviously the little red lenses as well, just to really make those stand out on the blue side of the armor. But every little detail, all fully painted. You've got claws written on the, that little scroll there, which is lovely. All the little um, armor lights and dials and buttons are all painted in that green, a green as well, uh, which is really cool. Cool. And you can see obviously all the text and everything on that purity seal done. Super sharp highlighting as you'll see all the way through, but all the eyes and everything done on the face as well. So an awesome, awesome miniature. And that's the uh, that's the Phobos, um, Phobos Lieutenant uh, from the three characters. And that's those three. Up next, we've got all the infantry coming. So get ready, they're coming up next from this awesome Shadow Spear commission. Uh, we'll see you guys in the next section. So next up, let's have a look at all the infantry from this awesome Brazen Claws Shadow Spear Commission. Um, really, really great selection of models that you do get in the Shadow Spear kit. Obviously, you've got the Eliminators, you've got the Suppressors, and then the 10 of the uh, Infiltrators, which are really, really cool mod models. Probably my favourite infantry type from the uh, Primaris range currently. Um, so let's dive in, have a look at the uh, models individually to start off with. We'll start with the Eliminators. Really, really awesome, awesome set of miniatures. Let's just get this to focus for you guys. Uh, there we go. Um, really, really cool job that uh, Ben's done here on the camo plug. Again, that sort of um, ash waste kind of scheme to match the basing as well, which is really lovely. And you can see that lovely uh, quartered uh, scheme on this awesome model. Um, again, all the purity seals done with the, with the green to complement and really make them stand out in the blue and red areas of armor. We've got those lovely, lovely white cowlings on all the weapons, and, which is really cool. 
all the little screens and everything all fully painted all the little lenses and lights all done as well which is really really good uh, so that's just the first of these eliminators we'll look at the sergeant from the squad uh, again he's got some awesome little details on him obviously he's got the binoculars there as you'll see with that lovely blended sort of screen on the front of it as well and uh, again every little detail fully painted to a super sharp finish uh, very clean and consistent miniature all the way around all the eyes and everything all painted all the little lenses and I do like the little touches like for example the lenses are re green and red to complement the sides of the armor so red on the blue side and green on the red side as well it's little touches like that um, that really show the attention to detail that we do put in here at Siege on your miniatures um, and then we'll have a look at the last of the uh, of the three uh, eliminators again similar sort of pose but obviously this chap's got a bare head uh, and you can see those goggles all again there with the green and red lenses uh, to complement the sides of the armor which is really cool uh, green lens on the rifle the little screen on the wrist all painted as well which is really lovely uh, so that's just the third eliminator then we'll move through and start having a look at the suppressors which again are the sort of heavier support type weapons for the force again a really really awesome model uh, very dynamic and looks like obviously he's just landing uh, while firing you can see obviously that the purity seal billowing away there while he's um while he's obviously flying and landing um got the heat bloom on the end of the gun as well which is really well done just to show obviously that the, the, he's been firing a lot you can really see that quarter scheme really nicely as well now if we have a look at the lenses on the helmet as well you will see much like on the goggles on the Eliminator, uh, Ben's done a great job of matching the lens to complement the colour of the side that it's on. So red on the blue side, green on the red side as well, just to really make those lenses stand out as you'll see there. And you'll see that across the force uh, when we have a look at the infiltrators after these guys as well. Um, pull forward the sergeant from the suppressors. You'll see obviously all the face and everything all fully painted, all the hair all done to a really nice standard. Uh, and again, every little bit of detail fully done in a super sharp fashion, super clean fashion. The white cowlings as well on the weapons, um, which is really, really lovely and again every little bit of, uh, of armor edge highlighted to a super super sharp fashion as well so that's just the sergeant and then we'll have the last one because obviously it's uh, not loads of models in this commission it'll be good to uh, to show you guys every model individually just so you can get a really good look at it uh, so this is the third suppressor here you can see really love that belt feed as well um, massive massive belt feed with loads of ammo obviously for him to uh, eliminate the heretics of the emperor um, so yeah great great miniature again you can see the lenses down on the head there obviously to complement each side of the quarter which is really really nice and then let's have a look at the the uh, 10 of the infiltrators um, always like this miniature since, since I saw it when it first came out a really really cool model and you can see obviously the quartered scheme there really lovely um, the smoke and everything all done through a little bit of highlighting down there just to really show it blowing away and you can see those lovely lovely lenses and that attention to detail on the different quarters there and just with matching colors to complement obviously green complementing the red and blue complement uh, and red complementing the blue uh, but all the green uh, grenades and everything all fully painted as well you can see all the super super sharp edge highlighting throughout on all of these and I'll just pull these forward as I'm going through I won't do every single one because uh, they are all the same, uh, pretty much as a couple of uh, double up poses on these guys. Again, that's just another one. The first of the two sergeants from the two five man units. So here you can see all the scars and everything all done, all the eyes and everything all fully painted, teeth, lips, everything all done. Uh, so that's just the first of the two sergeants. Really like his poses if he's just uh, uh, bellowing on his, uh, his brothers. You can see the screens and everything all done there with all the buttons and everything. And then uh, let's have a look at this chap here. He's just advancing, uh, so you can see him as well. Really like how he's a bit more relaxed with the wielding of the weapon as well. Uh, just looking for a new target. You can see those purity seals there with all the text and everything done on them as well. Uh, so that's just him. And then the guy with the pistol drawn, which I do really like this pose a lot. Again, you can see all the little lenses on the bolt is all done. Little de bits of detail like the bullets and things are all fully painted and highlighted as well through various stages. Um, so that's just the chap with the pistol. The second squads, again, we've got some similar poses. So just really quickly, you can just so you can see the consistency from miniature to miniature. Um, exactly the same poses in the previous squad, but done to the exact same consistency and quality. Same with this chap here uh, from the other squads. Again, just to show you guys the consistency from miniature to miniature. Really lovely quartered scheme on these. The other sergeant, which I do like him as well, he's just ordering in some form of reinforcement or strike perhaps, which is really cool. All the eyes and everything done on him. Moving around, you can see the consistency of the highlighting of the uh, quartering as well on these, which is really lovely. Uh, so that's just the other sergeant. And then my favourite miniature from probably the, the, the this, these uh, infiltrators is the, the medic kind of guy. I do really like the little vials and things on his wrist and little screen. I think that's quite cool. Um, but you can see the white cowling and light lenses all done on this guy as well. Um, moving around, just so you can see the quartering on this uh, miniature as well. But really, really super, super clean, um, which we really like to do for our clients here at Siege. And then the last guy with the, another one with his pistol 
angle drawn, uh, just as you can see him. I do absolutely love this pose, I think it's great. Uh, so that's just the other infiltrator. Uh, and that is all the infantry from the force, guys. I do hope you've liked it. So thanks for watching the video guys, I hope that you have enjoyed it. While you're here on YouTube, help us out by subscribing to the Siege channel. We upload at least three videos a week, so make sure you hit that bell icon to be notified when a new video is live. To see more, go follow us on our other social media where you can keep up to date with what we get up to and interact with us. If you're looking to learn from us, we offer online tuition on Patreon and physical classes nationally in the UK. Finally, to get your free quote today, click the link in the description of this video. From all the team here at Siege and myself, a massive thank you for watching the video and I'll see you on the next one. Take care.